Okay, eliminate each other. We have Filipino Chad going up against PR Rog. PR Balrog just made it out to the house. Uh, I think this past week? A couple of weeks ago, I think. All right. But it was very recent, yes. I'm sure they've gotten a significant amount of practice time together, regardless. I'm sure lots of people will know as long as you're watching, because they're on 24-7. Yeah, as gamers, as four incredibly strong gamers living in a house together, you got to believe that they, they train together, they know each other's inside and out. They're, they're everyone's styles, everyone's tendencies. So expect this to be a match that goes well beyond the characters. Or somebody could just land a hit and blow the other guy up. It is Marvel 3. <laughs> That's right. Anything can happen. All right, PR Rog uh, against, in the previous match against Noel Brown, did not opt to go with his Felicia team, but he does so right now up against Filipino champ. Guess he's confident in, in her, Felicia's chances against Phoenix. Oh, and he picks up Magneto. Here he goes. All right, nice. He's going for that combo. Zip, zip, up grapple. It's a bionic maneuvers, and he's gonna be able to DHC to finish him off. And is he going to hard tag right back into Spencer? Probably not, because Dante super takes too long. Nice catch with that air throw. Pierre Barak picked Dante back up on this uh, in this version of the game when he decided he could get enough damage. Originally, dropping him. And you saw right there, just trying to escape as fast as possible. Once Phoenix got snapped in, nice thing about having Dr. Doom is he can take a lot of damage. Oh, that was sick. Oh, oh that reset. was extra sick. Now, he can kill Phoenix before she gains the meter if he can just catch her with one hit. I don't think he's going to get it. Oh, he wait, got here it. we go. But he's got it. He's got it. He's got it. There it is. Just oh, like I said, it was right there. Be right up, there. Rock. You can barely see the yellow on the meter. <laughs> One pixel away from getting it. And he's been swapping between Dante and Wesker, depending on the matchup all day. Going oh. with Dante, I think just for that reason. The Filipino champ getting the first hit here. Nice counter there. Oh. Oh, really good use of that stand light. And an uncommon, uh, slightly uncommon Dante assist using the weasel there. All right, he's going to snap Phoenix in. He knows he's not going to be able to finish oh, her off he like last round. Her. Oh, no. Drops the combo, but he's still got her like that. Knew that snap. that was coming. He's got to snap immediately. He's got to snap immediately. Come on. No, he's going to finish off Magneto. Wow. I don't, maybe he's going to go for the X Factor tech. Oh, nice command throw there. He has been landing those scoops all day. Plenty of meters here to kill Doom. DHC like to Dante. And this is exactly who he wants in against Phoenix. He wants to open her up once. No, it's just Felicia now. All right, so he wanted to make sure Doom was down. So now he's got to deal with Dark Phoenix here. What kind of tech does he have? So he's going to get the Dark right here. Yeah, yeah, he did too many hits, so he wasn't going to go for the X-Factor tech. He's just going to fight it out. Goes for it. Really? Oh, whoa, and he's happy birthday! What on earth was his game plan there? The team super didn't seem to work very well there. He's giving F Champ too big of a chance to come back here. Advantage Champ. Oh, and the, the feathers give him one extra chance. But not enough of a chance there. Taken out. And now Filipino Champ ties it up 1-1. Pierre Balrog just made some bad decisions there. Did he go for a team super yeah. while Champ was at the top of the screen? He could have gone for the familiar X Factor air exchange tech, uh, combo, but instead he just did too many hits on the ground and let Filipino Champ go dark. 
Really bad choice there from PR Barrock. Surprising, gotta ask him what he was going for there. Oh! Doom's gonna knock him out of the combo. All right, and here he goes. Picked up Magneto. Uh, after he... all that, Pierre Barrock getting the first clean hit. Will he snap here? No. No, first game he was able to finish them off by just killing Phoenix directly. Let's see if he's gonna go for that again or if he's gonna snap Doom in. Snap Doom out. Ooh. Getting incredibly aggressive with that zip line. He could get grabbed, but no, he gets opened up low. Now I don't think killing Doom is going to be able to be his best strategy. But once again, and nice again, there. He knows which direction he's going to go. He's got to snap. He's got to snap. He's got to do this one. Oh, he caught her. Arm. It's looking bad for Champ. Oh, wait. Here we go. He has an opportunity for him. With that level Ooh, three nice extra pick up. speed. All right, now Spencer coming in with no life. Oh, great throw into X Factor. Oh no, dropping the combo He's button. Got him. Yeah, hit touching a button. This Filipino champ and PR Rog defeats Filipino champ and uh, Phil and PR Rog giving a nice hug to all of his friends. He's been eliminating nothing but friends all day. And that's a tactic we're going to see more and more as, for, as uh, Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3 ages. The incoming air block guard cancel uh, X-Factor air grab. Works so well against so many meaty mix-ups. And PR Barwalk just used it there to advance himself into the top eight. Loser side.